Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Bibi and I am a single mom of two. I have a 15 year old Sagittarius son and a 12 year old Taurus daughter. And on my channel, I go through my financial journey. And Cece here, the sea turtle, would like to remind you to like this video and subscribe to my channel. So, now I just finished and did uh, my uh, budgeting video. And now I'm doing uh, my sinking funds. I'm, I'm going to be cash stuffing. I'm sorry. I'm going to be doing cash stuffing of 823 dollars so this layout here is my cash envelope i added the spending back into this um category and um i have some money left over more than i thought i would um i did get some funds from my mom um to contribute to groceries so that and I got some funds uh, from someone else too. So um, miscellaneous still has its five dollars. Um, why don't we go ahead and count first my um, cash stuffing because I'm supposed to be cash stuffing eight hundred and twenty three dollars. And I will show that to you guys in just a second here. This is my cash uh, breakdown, and I do want to apologize. I forgot who actually gifted this, this to me because I purchased the envelope here, this cash wallet thing here from them, and they actually sent me um, this cash breakdown uh, thing here. And you can use alcohol to rub it off and then you, so it's reusable. Um, and seeing as I don't know your name, I'm going to make sure that I put a link to your Etsy shop in my description. I have to remember to do that. Okay. So my breakdown is, so I'm supposed to get $823 here. I already counted it and know that it's $800, $823, but we're going to count it for you guys. So let's go 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 500, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 600, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 700, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 800. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23. Ooh, I don't know if you guys heard that. That was my stomach. It's rumbling. I'm hungry. So, anyway, why don't we go ahead and put this in my... Okay. So, we're going to work backwards since it's already set up backwards. Excuse me. So I already have $5 left in my miscellaneous. I'm going to put that aside for right now and go ahead and add the $5. One, two, three, four, five, and the 10. I'm gonna go see my sister a little later today. So that's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, so. That's for that. I did say I was going to tell you guys one thing about myself every video. So the second thing um, I'm going to tell you about myself um, is, I probably already mentioned it already, is um, money. Not money. <laughs> no, not money. Numbers. I love numbers. 
Um, I was pretty much a dweeb at high school. I used to make up um, equations just so I can do them. Um, I, I, because one thing about numbers, no matter what, it's always one plus one will always equal two. No matter what you do to it. Now you can manipulate the one and the one to cut, to bring out a, um, another number that you want, but one plus one will always equal two. Always, no matter what. So that's what I like about the numbers. You, it's a surefire thing, you know. Um, so that's one of the things that about me. Okay, so that's it. Oh, and the other thing is, I wanted to let you guys about Upside. It's an app that you can download on your phone, and you can uh, get cash back on your gas purchases, also restaurant purchases and groceries purchases depending on your area that where you are at um it's definitely for gas so um if you use my code and my link in my description you can get up to 15 cents per a gallon back on your first claim so check that out so that's for miscellaneous i'm going to put that over here for right now next is spending so I added this back into my cash envelope and I have um, uh, $8 here. So that's going to go over here for right now. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it. But um, this is getting 15 and that's going to be the three fives. So 5, 10 and 15. Actually... And I think about it, I'm going to go ahead and roll over that five. Okay, so now it has 20 in it. So if I have anything left up to five dollars, I will roll over. So if I have a five, I will roll it over into the next week for spending. That way we have more stuff to spend. We have more money to spend. Eating out, I have $5 left. That's going to go over here for right now. And this time around, eating out is only going to get $25. So that's a two, two 20s and a five. The reason why it went down is because I added the spending. So that's $20, $25. And I usually don't go get anything out. My kids usually, I like to treat my kids at least once a week that they go out and get something. Usually it's through the drive-thru, which is a bad thing. The drive through ones are really bad, except for um, Panera Bread, but they're expensive. You know, they're, they, they're the more healthier one in my area, but they're expensive. The next is grocery spending groceries and I have $15 left in that I'm going to roll over 10 and if I remember this correctly I should get two 20s a 10 two 10s and three fives Let me make sure that that is correct 20 40 60 70 75 80 nope 20 40 50 60 65 70 and 75 and then $75.80, $10 rolling over from last week. Okay. I really need to spend that couple of dollars that I have left at um, uh, Target. Next is gas. Of course, I'm going to roll this over and I'm going to keep rolling this over because there's all, I know that there's going to be a week where for some reason something happens and I have to roll uh I don't have enough gas you know with kids and everything um I should go ahead and do that so gas the ten dollars that I have in there is going to get rolled over again and I have thirty dollars initially in it now for the the Next week, I'm going to keep that until the end of this video because I'm not quite sure which denominations I'm supposed to have for that. 
and I'll be able to figure that out at the end of this um, video. So I'm going to go ahead and put this back in my Miss Betty Boob here. Okay. All right. Betty Boop is going to go over here for right now. Let's just put her here for right now. So um, next we'll go into Rent. Yeah, this is not the right case. I should have gotten a bigger case, but this was the only one they have. But I really like this material. It's very durable. I'm going to have to figure out some other way to keep these um, in a bag or maybe get a bigger one like I got this one because this one's pretty big. I don't know. I, I can't keep buying things that, that doesn't work because this can work out for maybe something else. Who knows? Okay, so rent is getting 300. So that's the three ones right there. Okay, beauty is getting 10. So, like I said, I emptied out my um, all of my sinking funds and we had allocated all the funds. And um, I allocated $20 into beauty. With the 10 is going to be $30. Kids has $10 and that's getting 25. That's two tens and a five. So that's 10, 20, 30, and $35. Close has 20 and that's getting five also. So that's 10, 15, 20, and $25. So the next couple of ones are just getting um, $5. So that's 20, and then a five. So that will be 25 also. Toiletry has a 10 in it, and that's getting another 5. Fun, which is my new um, sinking fun, that's going to get, um, let me see here, that's going to get 5 also. And it's not going to get the $2 from the miscellaneous that I said I was going to start doing. Okay, let me put that over here. The next one would be house. House is getting $5. House already has $500 in the bank. In my high yield savings account, so that's going to get it. So now it has 505 in it. Car maintenance has 20. That's getting another $20. So that's 40. Snowball that is getting a five also. That's two tens and a five. That's 25 there. Birthday is getting its usual 20. 50, 6, 70, 80, and 90. My daughter's birthday is in a couple of weeks. And she is just plotting and planning all of what she wants there. Um, next is vacation. Vacation has $100 in the bank. And then the vacation is also getting $5. So that's 105. Next is buffer. Buffer still has $10 in it, and that's getting a five also. Savings rollover is also getting a five. And 
This is from last week, the last time I got paid, um, last week, rollovers 20, 21, 22, and then with a five will be 27. Okay, and I'm going to keep this out because some of the stuff that I have left over from my cash envelopes will be going into the rollover. Dollar is getting the dollar here. I'm not going to count that. Okay. And then the 26 week challenge is going to get $20 and then 19, which is $39 altogether. So that would be 20 and 19. Look at that. I'm already up to 20 and 19. 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, and 39. One hundred, two hundred, three hundred, twenty, forty, fifty, fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three. So that's three hundred and sixty-three. Okay, so that is that. I'll put this over here for right now. So the next thing I'm going to do is the envelope challenge here. And that's going to get the 10 and four ones. The first one is the 14. So 14 there. Next is 13. And then the last one for this week I'm going to be putting in is 16. So that's 10, a 5, and a 1. Okay. So the next thing will be self-care. I'm going to get this and get my coloring pencil because I'm going to color and do everything together. I was looking for that. Okay. So. Here we go. So. This would be. I'm getting a five. So. I'll a color of five. Is that five? Yep. I think that was the wrong color. Not very good at the coloring in the lines thing here, but I did my best. So, is done for that. Um, the next thing here should be what I have left for uh, next week for my cash envelope. So that's 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10. 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So, that's $155 going towards my cash envelope for next week. So, there we go for that. Now, what I'm going to do with the rollover money here, I will be rolling over this into my savings rollover. I guess I could count that for you guys. 20, 45, 50, 55, 60. Oh, 
20, 40, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, and 42. So that's a good amount of money here that I am going to be stuffing into my 100 envelope at the end of the month. So, and I have, this is only the second week of April. It's the only the second, yeah, it's only the second week of April. So, and I already have $43, $42 towards my savings challenge, aka 100 envelope challenge. That's pretty good. So, there we go. I'm going to put the $3 that I had left into the dollar challenge. If I get another envelope, I could use that little one, this one right here, because I know it's too small for these. Um, I could actually use that for the 100 envelope, for the, the dollar, the dollar ones. Um, that is if I keep focusing on it and putting them in here, right? Yeah, I think so. Because you see, I can't even put, yeah. So, if I do get a, a different envelope, that is. So, that's it for this, for today. Um, thank you so much for joining me. Um, I look forward to seeing you guys on my next video. So, see you guys then. Bye. Mm -hmm.